Hello everyone and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be baking a shortbread biscuit which is another great recipe and it's absolutely delicious and you can have it with a spread of marmalade or any fruit jam that you like. It's a nice biscuit to share with your friends when you have them over for a nice cup of tea and a bit of a gossip on a Sunday afternoon. And here it is and I'm going to show you how to bake it. I'm going to start by mixing the butter, the sugar, the vanilla essence until light and creamy. When it becomes light and fluffy, stop whisking and add the eggs, one at a time. Keep mixing until all the ingredients are combined. Next, add the oil little by little. Use the spatula to get all the bits from the side and mix them again all together. Keep whisking until it becomes thick and creamy. And this is how it should look like. Thick and creamy. Next, add the flour in two batches. All right, keep folding in the flour until combined together and it becomes like a bowl, like that. And here I have a tin, 30 by 20 centimeters, already greased and the base lined with baking paper. Place the dough into the tin. And now press it down until it becomes even. With the back of a spoon, keep pressing the dough into the tin until you actually get it 
nice and flat. Once the dough is in the tin nice and flat, use a knife to mark squares on the top. Don't go right through, just mark the surface of the cake. And this is where we're going to cut the slices later, or the squares, I should say. And here it is already marked in squares and it's ready to go in a preheated oven 160 degrees Celsius for 20 minutes or until it's lightly colored. And after 20 minutes I'm going to check and see if the shortbread is ready. Oh yes, and it's just right, a nice golden color. Before you do anything else, let it stand for 10 minutes to cool down. 10 minutes up, and now I'm gonna finish cutting the squares. And then I'm gonna let it stand until it gets cold completely before turning them out. The shortbread is ready to be sandwiched and I'm going to show you how to do it. And here we have marmalade and fig jam which I have actually made myself. Remove them gently so it doesn't crumble. And I'm going to cut them in half. I'm going to use some of the marmalade and spread it over. And next, I'm going to use the fig. Spread it onto the sandwich and I'm going to carry on doing that until I use the whole lot. I've done a few just to show you and now I'm going to sprinkle some icing sugar over the top. Okay, and here you have it. And after all this hard work, it's time for a taste. Mmm. I can tell you now, this is divine, it's absolutely delicious and the best way to have it is with a nice English cup of tea. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you have enjoyed watching the video and I hope to see you again with my next recipe. Thank you for watching. Bye.